Welcome back to E Sim Studios. My name is Taylor Bell. All right, I wanted to get into a little topic today called security. Yes, security. Security encompasses everybody. And this next topic, this next subject, this next company I'm about to talk about does and will um, potentially cover everybody or could, right? Now, they did not sponsor. They did not pay for uh, me talking about them. Excuse me. Let me mention how this came about, right? <clears throat> so I was going through my comments uh, in the comment section, as I always do uh, on a daily basis, try to answer and or respond to each and every comment and or question that people leave, right? In our comment section, we have a lot of subscribers and uh, people asking about all sorts of questions, right? I got video topics. Our channel covers all mobile industry, mo mobile technology more specifically. But I was going rolling through the comments, what was it, yesterday? And noticed uh, on on one of my videos that I did maybe six months ago, uh, somebody or the message was from somebody named Ifani, and and it was uh, again in regards. I did a SIM swap video explaining. I've done multiple SIM swap videos, trying to get the message out there to you, the viewer, or anybody, right? Anybody. Uh, not just the subscribers of the channel, but to anybody that searches SimSwap on Google, our video does pop up in one of the uh, recommendations, right? So um, I think I've made maybe three over the last year. This channel is about a year old, a little over a year old, 15 months old. And I've made maybe three, three, maybe four, right? Videos, SimSwap. <laughs> what it is, um, how the hackers perform the SIM swap, how you can protect yourself. I'm just trying to get the message out there. Uh, it's a knock on wood. It's never happened to me personally, or I guess any anybody in my family. Um, it is, uh, I have a client uh, my, uh, that had this happen to them. And they drained my client's bank account. I think it was like $43,000. I mean, it was a freaking headache. I can just imagine uh, how, you know, just, oh God, I don't even, I can't even imagine how bad it would be. Now, long story short, um, so uh, this uh, message was left by Ifani explaining uh, kind of to some of the points I was making in the video, as far as descriptions on um, adding to my points that I had made in the video, just some information on SIM swapping and how it's done and how it's performed and stuff like that. And I, was, and I responded back and said, well, thank you for that information. Uh, I really appreciate it. Uh, I didn't know that. I always like to learn. So I don't take somebody giving me information as like, uh, you know, I encourage it, right? I want to know as much as possible. So I was like, Afani, Afani, Dan, that's a weird name. I, I don't think that's a person's name. Um, I think it's a company. It sounds like a company name. So I Googled it. Um, and I also clicked on the profile um, of the uh, channel that commented, right? You can do that as well. So it pulled up Afani. It was a company YouTube page. I was like, huh. And so I Googled Afani, went to their webpage, and as I was doing some homework on Afani, I was like, wow, this is really cool. Like, uh, there's nothing else like it uh, in the mobile industry, uh, mobile technology. And there's nothing like it. It's, it's one of a kind. I was kind of blown away by everything that they do. I think it's a phenomenal um, idea, a phenomenal um uh, idea to start a company. And apparently what they do is they guarantee that you as a customer, once you sign up for service, will not be SIM swapped. And they actually have 
a, uh, I believe it's a $5 million guarantee or insurance policy. I'm not sure the correct term that they had, but forgive me. Um, from my understanding, and, and we'll check out the website, I might get better clarity. From what I understood, loose homework is uh, if you get SIM swapped, you get $5 million. I don't know. Uh, I'm sure somebody will correct me, but let's let's get into it now. Um, I do have a, um, a video. I went to their YouTube channel and I actually took a clip of the owner. I'm assuming it's the owner um, speaking about his experiences. He started the company uh, from his own personal experience. He was a victim of a SIM swap and basically went through the whole rigmarole of trying to um, get your money back and just trying to regain as much money and information and at very least your phone number back as you can, right? So he will explain in this video. Now, I had to edit the video because I don't want to get flagged for copyright. So I had to change the voice a little bit and add some visual effects so the video doesn't get flagged. But um, And it's just like two minutes long. Um, it's a really, really cool, uh, company idea and let me pull up their webpage. You know what? Let me play this real quick. Let's get into it. And I am a SIM swap victim in the past. It's one of the reasons why Afani exists and it is a painful thing to go through because they got into six of my applications in 61 minutes and then ported it back to my phone. That sort of freaked me out. That's why having the a funny safe plan when you're an international traveler is a must have. But the problem with the SIM swap is your hardware and applications on that phone become completely obsolete because it's totally taken out of the equation. Your mobile service is now pointing from the network to their phone. Your phone is completely out of the equation. It's a very damaging thing. So there is a solution to protect against this. It's called the Afani safe plan. But most importantly, I've had SIM swap protection. I can take long flights, I can play golf, I can go to sleep, I can go to meetings and not have to worry about going back to my phone to find out that my mobile account has been stolen away, especially after a really long flight. In addition to that, the safe plan includes a $5 million insurance policy against specifically against SIM swap losses. Afani's never had a SIM swap loss, but we're going to ensure that you never get SIM swap. We want to protect our business and our business reputation as much as we want to protect you. What Afani does is we remove your personal information so the carrier employees no longer can access and get your personal information. So that is an extra layer of privacy to make sure that prying eyes cannot get in access to your information. Our SIM card is uh, offered in an unbranded SIM card. And we also offer the eSIM option, which we always recommend. Go with the eSIM with Afani because we lock it in. We have an 11 layer authentication step and that includes steps that are manual and technical and a few steps that you won't recognize or see that's going on to ensure that you never get SIM swapped and that your information is never uh, received by anybody other than you as the owner of that mobile account. So with Afani, not only are you getting a great mobile service with voice, SMS and data in US, Canada, Mexico, and then with one of the options, you're getting global roaming data as part of that same price, no additional price. You're getting a $5 million insurance policy and you're getting privacy by not having your personal information, your call records, your SMS call records sitting out there in an account attached to your name. Afani does not collect your call records, your SMS records. We only collect information to authenticate you and information for you to pay your bill. We understand what our value is. It's very simple. It's SIM swap protection, a great mobile service, insurance, and privacy. That's what we're offering today. I doubt anyone comes anywhere close to us. We are a monthly service with no contract, and we want you to have a relationship with us as your mobile operator. Come join our secure mobile service, our secure mobile community. would love to have you. There you have it. That is the, <clears throat> I assume, the CEO and or owner and or founder of Ifani, the mobile service provider. Now, um, without digging too deep into how SIM swapping works, uh, it's typically done from inside the company. Um, as the this has be, begun to be uh, uh, more popular, unfortunately, a lot of these 
are, as I mentioned, performed from inside. It's an inside job. So one of the things that makes Afani um, different from other mobile carriers is that they don't keep any personal information, right? Because here's how it works. So a lot of the, a lot of the times an employee of T-Mobile will get bribed or somebody gets a job with T-Mobile in, in anticipation of stealing or, and or working for the bad guys or the hackers. So they will intentionally get a job at a T-Mobile um, to eventually have access to all these records because um, I've heard stories, even uh, I'm in San Antonio, there was a story, uh, I saved it and I should have pulled it up, um, but I just thought of it right now. Uh, Seguin, which is like a small town outside of San Antonio, a store employee was arrested, I think it was like five or six months ago, and they stole with the help of somebody. Uh, well, they were the... Uh, the T-Mobile employee was the person that gained access to the account. They stole like $86,000, right? But how it happened was the investigators, the news article said that the T-Mobile employee was approached by uh, somebody, uh, a group or an individual, offered them, I think it was like twenty dollars or $30,000 in cash, cash money, to access... Uh, and or pass along access and or SIM swap from inside T-Mobile um, a uh, victims uh, with an S and took off with a bunch of the customer's money because um, SIM swapping, what they do is, and the reason why it has to be, it doesn't have to be, but typically it is an inside job, is that what they do is they take your phone number, right? So on your phone, you have your banking apps, you have uh, any cryptocurrency um, apps. Um, so what they do is they take you, and it's all tied onto your phone, into your phone number, right? So a lot of the times what they do, and what he mentioned is, um, he in the video that I trimmed out, he did mention that he goes to, I think it was Malaysia or somewhere in the Southeast Asia quite often. And you're on like 11-hour flight, six-hour flight. Well, that gives them enough time to hack into your account and take a bunch of whatever, uh, funds, cryptos, what have you. So what they do is they will take your phone number. They will take your phone number from inside a T-Mobile or Verizon. I think all of the carriers have had this issue. And they will port your phone number to the bad guy's phone. So the bad guy will attempt to sign in to a... And a lot of the times they'll have access uh, to your Gmail account as well, right? But the phone number is important because what they will do is, as I mentioned, port your number to their phone, and then they'll go into they'll uh, sign up for Chase or um, download the app or Bank of America or even on their computer, and they'll hit on purpose. Forget forgot my password. So then it'll text you, the victim, a uh, temporary password, something of the sort, but that temporary password is not going to you. It's going to your phone number, but your the bad guy has your phone number. So then once he's got the temporary password, he signs into the banking apps, he signs into the crypto apps, uh, more than likely they'll have access to your, uh, hack into your, your, your Gmail and, uh, bypass the two FA, uh, security and they'll, you know, they can get that done in less than an hour, right? Probably 30 minutes, I bet. So um, that's why typically it's an inside job. Um, and what makes this so um, interesting is they do not. So they basically safe proof Afani by not keeping your records or at least records on file. Now, they, they're an MVNO. Sort of like how Mint Mobile is an MVNO. They buy Spectrum uh, from a big named carrier and then basically resell that Spectrum. Now, they did not say, and I know why, they did not say who they are an MVNO for. Um, that goes into the privacy deal because 
um, they don't want you to know. Or I'm sure they, they might tell you. Or I, I don't know. They probably won't, right? Because if somebody's trying, like, now, they, anybody can sign up for this. You can, I can sign up for Ifani. Right now, I believe it's $99 a month for one line, right? So it's a more expensive than a T-Mobile. I think Mint Mobile is like 15 bucks a month. But you get, you know, your information is out there for people to hack into or T-Mobile employees to get into or Mint Mobile employees to get into. Ifani, um, last time I checked yesterday, it was 99 bucks a month. However, you do get the $5 million uh, insurance policy, as as he mentioned, but they don't necessarily put on display who they get their spectrum through, because, and they do that on purpose, right? Um, because they don't want uh, they, uh, as I mentioned, it's open. It's open for everybody to sign up for, but their target group, their target uh, market is uh, high rollers, politicians. Uh, people in the crypto industry, uh, Fortune 500 companies, Fortune 500 CEOs, executives, um, I'm sure doctors, lawyers, um, anybody basically that has a lot to lose needs to get a funny. Now, if you're an average person like you and me, um, you can sign up for it, right? If if that interests you, right? Um, if you don't even want to go take the chance of going through that headache of being some swapped, be my guest, sign up for it. Look, they didn't, this is not a sponsorship. This is not, uh, they didn't pay for this. I'm going to at them in the video because look, this is a really, really, and this is what caught my attention. This is a really cool idea. It's a really neat idea. Um, it's a long time coming. I didn't even think of having a service provider that guarantees no SIM swaps, right? Like now that I think about it, I'm like, damn, that's a really, really good idea. That's why I wanted to make a video about this because they're doing everything the right way. And yes, it is more expensive, but you get the insurance, uh, not only the $5 million insurance, but the mental, uh, emotional insurance of not having to worry about uh, your info being stolen from the inside out, basically. Um, and that's why they don't publicly uh, announce who they buy their spectrum from because they don't, if they say, oh, we get ours from um, T-Mobile. I'm picking on T-Mobile on purpose because they seem to have uh, a large number of, of data breaches recently. So they deserve to get picked on. Um, they're not saying uh, we buy our spectrum from T-Mobile because Anybody buying Spectrum, routing it through T-Mobile, essentially has a route to you. So they don't want to put on display, oh, yeah, we got our Spectrum through T-Mobile or we get our Spectrum through AT&T because it's just one extra step that they just handed the bad guys, right? So they're doing that on purpose. They It's not that they're trying to be – well, they are trying to be secretive. Huh? So the bad guys don't, don't know. The less information the bad guys know, the better. So that's what Ifani is doing. Now – I'm actually going to reach out to the company um, behind the scenes and see if I can possibly get an interview. I don't know how that's going to go um, or some kind of extra, uh, some, some kind of official. Uh, I don't know. I, I find this stuff cool, but I'm going to reach out and see if maybe I can speak to a marketing team or PR team or somebody and uh, see if I can get a, you know, short form interview 10, 15 minutes long. Um, if that interests you, <clears throat> um, the viewers, uh, I think it, you know, some of these SIM swap videos and these security videos don't get a lot of views, but I'm not worried about that. I just want this to get out to the public. So I know there's people out there that do worry about this stuff. It is a headache, right? If you have, um, even if you have 60 grand saved, right? Why not? Uh, secure that. I mean, uh, these things are, <laughs> these phones are a wonderful piece of technology, but man, it gives so much insight to the, your, your private life and your personal life that, um, seems like nowadays anybody can access. So Ifani is the name. Let's go to their website real quick. Um, let's see. 
so here's their story. It kind of he kind of went over it, but um, it's kind of cool. Uh, I'm I'm assuming that's Haseb Awan, and I hope I'm saying his name correctly. I'm probably not, but Haseb Hasib Hasib Awan. I bet that's what it is. Hasib Awan he is the co-founder of the world's first and largest uh, Bitcoin ATM. He was a prime target for hackers. Yes. Even though he tried using multiple phone service carriers, he was the victim of four SIM swap attacks. Holy crap. No wonder why he made this company. You're funny. So this will basically, I'm in the, uh, and I will link this website in our description box. Um, this is the about or about us or our story section, and it'll break down. I'm not going to break it down. I've done it numerous times, but um, you can either read this here on the website or you can find one of our previous videos. But um, it says that um, he started it because he was a victim four times. They give you their vision, their mission, and here is the home page. And I think you can sign up here. Now, look, if you want to sign up for service, um, executives trust you funny for robust phone security and guaranteed protection against him. So, oh, yeah. And he did mention, look, you can have all you can have all of the um, you can have all of the uh, VPNs. You can have all of the um, uh, security apps on your phone, right? You can, you can have them all and it means nothing because the way they get into your accounts, the way they get into your private, uh, and personal accounts is through your phone numbers, through your SIM swap. So it doesn't matter if you have an Android, it doesn't matter if you have an iPhone, if somebody wants to get in, they can get in simply through the phone number and or SIM swap. Um, so that's what he was that's what he was mentioning on um that video. I think I cut some of it out unfortunately, but it's pretty interesting. Look, it shows that I think getting back to if you want to sign up for service, I didn't see a uh you know, basically buy here now. It says actually it does right here. Let's see what they say. Okay, so here's the pricing plans, plans that fit to your needs. So you can pay monthly, black seal protection. Well, annually, is it cheaper? Yeah, so it is a little cheaper annually. But um, now let's see, the monthly, the safe plan or the black seal plan? This is the probably the one that most general public would purchase, as in me or you. Now, if you're an executive, if you um, have a ton of money in crypto, um, if you're a high roller, a very important person, a politician, you're probably going to want, want to get this because this is, it looks like a lot to me and you, right, the average person. But if you have a ton of money, a ton of assets, 249 a month or what was it annually, $2,500 a year, you would gladly pay that to have the assurance that your funds and your assets are not going to be stolen from you, right? Like I would pay that without even second guessing myself or anything. Um, if I was, you uh, know, a VIP or a, an executive, like look at all this cool stuff they got. Look, let's go back. Let me change it to this and see. So the 99 bucks a month gets you unlimited data across North America, global high-speed data, unlimited texting, 200 countries, hotspot, Wi-Fi calling. Okay, so the, because that's how I was wondering, I was like, well, they say $5 million insurance policy, but what if they only apply that to their most expensive plan, right? So that's what I was expecting to see, the $5 million insurance policy only under the Black Seal plan. But no, I was incorrect. The safe plan that's $99 a month does include the $5 million insurance policy and a 60-day 100% money back guarantee. Now, let's look at the cool stuff. Let's see what this one offers. So for $249 a month, the Black Seal Protection. Look at all this cool stuff. 
location tracking and fake tower detection. That's big for defending against hackers. Now, fake tower detection, what is that? Well, um, your mobile phone will ping. Uh, there's a way to find out, and the carriers have that access. Remember, a lot of these attacks are coming from within the ins with it. It's like an inside job. So they would have access to information of knowing what tower you're connected to, meaning like where you are at, like locating you. They, uh, you, that's all info. Actually, you can pull download an app. Uh, I probably should have done it for this video, but whatever. You can find out on your phone what tower you're connected to. And uh, this is telling you with this Black Seagull plan, it'll give you fake tower detection, meaning instead of being connected to this tower over here, it'll say I'm connected to that tower over to the left uh, or to the right, you're right, you know, 20 miles, I don't know. So that's cool. Silent SMS, spoof and spam calls. Doesn't say blocking or providing. I'm not sure if that blocks them or um, pretends to make calls. IMS eye catchers. Uh, a lot of people, a lot of these bad guys have IMS eye catchers. It's just another identification number that's slapped to your uh, mobile device that hackers want and or need. DNS leakage and hijacking. That's important. And then DDoS attack is, is uh, important as well. So it, their more expensive plan does provide a few more, more intense um, uh, offerings, I guess you could say. So let's pretend, oh, look at this. It's invite only. Okay, interesting. So this one's open to the public. The 90, and this $99 safe plan should be fine for 99% of people. Uh, I think the Black Seal one is for like, uh, you know, certain a certain very small percentage of people, but they do offer it. So let's pretend that we are going to sign up. But one second, let me just see here. Uh, who was that? Charlie Sheen. Oh, Charlie... Shrem, founder of the Bitcoin found. God, can you imagine this guy that started a funny said he got hat or some swapped four times because he started uh, a lot of these crypto people are massive targets for the uh, sim swappers because they can get in there and drain the uh, crypto accounts. Um, can you imagine how many, how paranoid you would be about getting some swapped all the time? Lord have mercy. Um, so he says, my cell phone has been ported twice and I no longer use SMS for any two factor. Yeah, I don't, I don't either. Um, it says I partnered with the funny to create the most secure global network. Never be hacked. Stay on any US network. $99 a month. Unlimited. What else we got? Common questions. Do I still need to pay my current cell phone provider if I switch to Fani? No, Fani becomes your wireless carrier and you will not be billed any further by your previous provider. What if what if I am on contract? We can take over any contracts and help you unlock your current device. We'll also cancel the billing for the previous contract. You basically port your number. That's standard practice when you port your number over to a, another carrier. How is this coverage? If any leverages America's most established wireless network, ensuring a 99.3% coverage rate uh, for high reliability and extensive reach. Do you have a refund policy? Certainly, we have a simple 60-day refund policy with a full 100% refund, no questions asked. Where are they located? San Francisco? Cool. Yeah, I'm going to reach out to them and just, I don't know, see what they say. Shoot. Um, I like this stuff. Cool. So let's see if you sign up for a plan. What the next steps are. Okay, so you basically select your plan. Uh, annually, save 16 a month. That's not bad. 83 bucks a month. And it looks pretty easy. You put in your email, your order details, your information. And then what else? Oh, how many lines you want as well. So, cool.
Well, um, I thought I came across this just randomly um, yesterday and thought, wow, that is real. I never even thought about a company that could be mad. I never knew they existed. I never, you know, knew. look, this is important for uh, the gentleman that started this. These are the types of people and individuals that the tech industry desperately needs um, moving forward. Uh, with new technology comes new advancements, comes uh, new risks, quite honestly. But it's people like this that actually take that next step, that do something about it, that are like an industry disruptor, right? Um, and that's kind of one of the reasons why I like Carl Pay and support nothing, right? I find them an industry disruptor. And that's why I want to support um uh, people and companies like this, right? Because they're putting their neck out there. They're doing something else nobody else is doing. And um, I applaud them. So uh, I want to thank Ifani for a really cool business idea. And I want to thank you, the viewer, for uh, joining us today. We got a lot of stuff on the way. We have case reviews, just got the iPhones in. So I've been ordering a bunch of stuff on Amazon to review for those. So um, we got the S24 news. And uh, what else do we got? Um, Pixel stuff. So tons of, stool, uh, tons of cool stuff on the way nonetheless. But uh, thank you very much. As I mentioned, thank you, Ifani. Again, they did not pay for this. I'm just simply a fan of technology and came across something cool. So. I appreciate the time today and uh, I will see you tomorrow. Peace out.